So we all know GPU prices are awful right now. But just how awful are they, and have they been getting better or worse? And that's what I want to look at in this video. Now, I stumbled on an interesting article here, but you know what? It's not in a language that I speak. <laughs> but the good news is I found a summary of this over at videocards.com. And I'll put a link to both of these things in the description of this video so you can take a look at all the details on your own, especially if you're able to speak um, I'm guessing this is German. Anyway, <laughs> uh, so what is this? Now, first of all, as we investigate these prices and analyze it, keep in mind that this is based on Euro uh, European prices. So that is different than the prices that we're seeing in the United States and might not be completely reflective of that. Um, but this is the most detailed analysis I could find on the topic that I wanted to bring to you guys. Okay. So the overall summary here is summed up pretty well by video cards, but basically, you know, the 30 series cards are three, three times as expensive as they should be, and the 6,000 series cards are about twice what they should be, and this is on average. But let's dig into more of the details. So here's the chart summarized with the uh, you know headings in English. So this is looking at the 6700 XT, the 6800, the 6800 XT, the 6900 XT. And then we're also looking at the 3060, the 3070, the 3080, and the 3090. Under each of these, we have what their MSRP should be. Again, these are looking at European prices, and that's why we're seeing these are, that's euros, right? I'm American, but that looks like an E. I'm assuming that's euros. <laughs> Apologize for my American ignorance. Anyway, so what we have here is by the month, and then what I'm fairly certain is the price range these were selling for on European markets. Again, I'm, I think this is mostly looking at what retailers are selling them for, not f what like scalper prices are. But as you can see from this, the retail prices might as well be scalping, <laughs> okay? Anyway, so again, we have months going from January, and it's not just months, I guess, here. You know, we've got multiple dates in January, February, March, April, and May, and how bad is it? So, well, how bad is it? We've got pretty bad is the answer. And what I was mostly looking at is, is it getting better? So let's zoom this thing in a bit. And I'll make sure I'm out of the way. <laughs> uh, I, could, I could even move my little uh, camera thing. Uh, would, would I be better on this side? Ah, it's, it's nice to be able to move wherever I want, right? OK. Uh, so <laughs> first of all, if we just kind of look at the trend here, looking at the 6700 XT, prices seem to be getting overall worse after the first month and definitely not getting better, although somewhat stable. The 6800, again, looks like it's getting worse over time, not better. The 6800 XT looks like it's getting worse over time, not better, although we do kind of see, at least right here, we had maybe a, a lower end version available for a bit. Uh, but still way above the MSRP, and the high end is still getting worse, not better. 6900 XT, we're looking at the low end, again, getting worse, not better, <laughs> and the high end also getting worse, not better. Excellent. This is what we love to see, isn't it? <laughs> All right, the 3060 hasn't been out for as long, but it's getting worse, not better. The 3070 is getting worse, not better. And the 3080 is getting, um, you know, pretty stably bad, I guess might be where I'd put that. Although right here, we're only seeing the uh, 3,000 euro uh, price right there, which is worse. Okay, and the 3090. Yeah, that's, I would put under the category is getting worse, not better. Maybe, you know, anyway, at least stably bad here in the last little bit. Okay, so my summary from all of this 
if we were all hoping that by mid-2021, the horrible prices would be starting to come down and stabilize, that is clearly not the case. I don't see anything on the horizon pointing to things getting better. And so I hadn't been I haven't been making a lot of videos recently and one of them was like the main thing I'd been interested in at the time was graphics cards and like this is why um I'm just I'm sure along with many of you pretty burned out on this. Um so my current plan is to just kind of hope the 4000 series comes out um, maybe not with better stock necessarily, but maybe some of, some of the supply with the pandemic and the and the mining craze maybe will have died down a bit. I don't know, but right now I'm hoping my trusty 2070 hangs in there a bit longer because yeah, this is absolutely nuts and like I said, seems to be getting worse and not better. <laughs> I hope you guys still manage to have an excellent day.